everyone, this is Stephanie Manley with copycat.com. Today I'm gonna to show you how to do a pork butt roast in an Instapot. Now if you don't have an Instapot, this will work with a slow cooker. Um, if you're using an Instapot, it'll work a little bit faster. So we're gonna go ahead and get started with this recipe. Now this recipe has a couple of different components. First off, we are going to make a marinade. I have a half cup of brown sugar in here and to this I'm gonna add about one cup of soy sauce. All right, so we have our soy sauce in here. Now I'm gonna add about a quarter cup of chopped garlic. This is chopped really, really large because this is gonna cook for a long time. So I'm just gonna give this a stir and I'm gonna put this to the side. So the next thing I have right here is a pork butt roast I bought on sale. I got this for just 97 cents. So um, what I want to do is I kind of want to make like a pulled pork type of dish. So I need to chunk this or cut it into chunks a little bit and we're going to saute it so it gets a little bit of nice brown seasoning. Now if you're doing this in a slow cooker, you can simply do this on the stove. Um, I can do this all in the uh, Instapot. So I've got it turned on to saute. So now I'm going to put this into large pieces in there. So I just wanna make a few cuts. We're just gonna wanna brown it up a little bit. So we'll come back when this is all browned up. Now you're not gonna cook it all the way, so we're just gonna brown the edges. All right, so this is browned well enough, so now I'm gonna stick all of this back into the pot. Now if you have a crock pot, you are gonna cook this for about six hours, six to eight hours on low. All I'm gonna do is I'm gonna add the marinade. Put that right in there. I'm gonna stick the lid back on. It's gonna sing me a song. And I'm gonna set this for meat and it will automatically cook this for me. It'll determine it's time for me. This is probably gonna take about an hour and a half, but again, slow cooker on low, six to eight hours. So we will come back when this is all done. So our pork roast is done and it's time to take it out. We need to release the steam in this so we can open up. I'm gonna just pull out a portion of it so you can see what it looks like. This will be great to shred later. You can see it's really nice and wonderfully tender. So I'm gonna get me a little plate and give this a taste. Before we go ahead and give this a taste, if you enjoy Instapot recipes, Drop me a comment down below and let me know what you'd like to see next. Remember, you can also do this in a crock pot. Six to eight hours on low will get you the same results. So don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel and like this video, please. We're gonna go ahead and give this a taste. Wow, really nice flavor. Incredibly tender. This will make great pulled pork sandwiches later. So if you enjoy these recipes, again, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss our next recipe. Thanks for watching.